Yeah. The rewards of self belief have turned me into an addict. Yeah. Girls cheating, being hoes has turned me into a savage. Hey, what's going on, guys? I go poker here with another video for you today. And today we're going to be doing another spoken word piece. But before we get into that, I need to say something. Biscuits. No, but seriously, uh, in the description below, there will be a link to a friend of mine who's uh, helping me out on Twitter by just, you know, retweeting my videos whenever he sees them, whenever I tweet at him, like, hey, can you retweet this, you know, all that. He's just awesome. Go check him out. He has a channel below. I will leave his channel link below and his Twitter link below as well. So go show him some love. Watch all those videos. This video can wait. He's fucking much better than me. Okay. Just fucking watch him. My, my friend also made this for me. It's fucking amazing. Ah, 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 ah. But anyways, <laughs> let's get into the spoken word piece. So... This one's called, you know, whatever the title says it's called. As I grew up, life was constantly changing. I fear change because though I can feel nostalgic, I feel so scared, never knowing what's coming. As I grew up, I went from playing games to doing drugs, to doing community service, to wanting to die. As I grew up, I constantly changed. Life was weird, always on the move, changing words to pictures to sand and dirt. Life changed a lot, but I've always lived under the poverty line. Cause mom and dad tried their best for a four, but money was an issue. Arguing like Democrats and Republicans, they were torn apart. I lived with the roof over my head, but when a home becomes a hell and becomes more radioactive and toxic than the power plant, life changes. For everyone, these bright eyes drain to be brown. Life changes for me. As I'm drowned, begging for help silently as a kid. I grew up, yet still so no and naive. When you live life as a philosopher who writes like a poet, politically driven, you have a heart of gold and a wallet of dust. Because you've traded wealth and fortune for the ability to care. Life changes all the time, especially for the poor boy before your eyes. So I wrote this during uh, my poetry class in college that, if you don't know, I go to college now. Scholar AF. Uh, yeah, I wrote that for the poetry class. And I guess I could, you know, read another because, you know, it's telling me this is under five minutes. And if for some reason I don't like videos under five minutes, it's just my thing. I'm a weirdo like that. So, uh, poetry book. If anything, I'll just, you know, look for a different one. I guess I'll do this one. This one's short, but I guess I could make it feel long. So this one's called Art. The beautiful emptiness and vivid colors of blue. And the trees of a forest and clear ponds representing intentions. The music of gods, a sweet harmony and low sound of an orchestra. The high pitches of a falsetto in musical theater, and soft vocals in rhythmic correlation with others, the dialogue and emotion-filled words of the stage. Visuals and auditory effects are at the forefront of entertainment. Romantic renaissance of modern days shows that all there is but art isn't supposed to look nice. It's supposed to make you feel something. So there's that one. And just for the hell of it, because I saw one I liked. 
I'll read that one too. So this one's called Drowning. So hey, three poems. That's a first, right? I don't know. I like I like doing this. Joker noises. Joker laugh. Joker. So this one's called Drowning. Slowly fading in the distance, my voice, for instance, levels the noise existing in poise, no poisoned and imprisoned. No escape for the screams, internally it all seems just too much for me, but how can that be? Now I could dream and forget the rhyme scheme, but are you sure that metaphor seems silly? And a simile won't convey the message that this is all my rite of passage. Food for thought. So why not think all you can? Be a man, human. But can can you do what you're supposed to? All these rush into my mind. Brain scrambled in the meat grind. So I try to get better and find shelter. Taking all the pills, I'm drowning. Them, I'm downing them all at once. In my own words, wor words worlds apart. It's a start. Now to the end, the oceans of words. I take a swim, trying to find the right ones, leave a room for puns. Tell my kin I took a dive, leave me dead, alive. Dead when I'm six feet under, and wonder, alive, and the words are left behind. So there's all the spoken word there is for this video, guys. Until next time. I'll see you later.